last episode. Plus five. Plus seven. Plus now. now. It's time for... Okay, let me tell you the secret. Why I can answer it so fast. Alright, I'm going to listen to you very carefully. Do you notice there are 50 numbers in the equation? From 1 to 10, there are 5 odd numbers. So from 1 to 100, there are 5 times 10, which is 50 odd numbers. So the answer is 50 squared, or 2500. Wait, I have a question. Why is 50 odd numbers starting from 1 to 99? The sum of it equals 50 squared. Is there a theory behind it? Let me show you why. I can show you this as a series of squares. We start with the square of area 1, which is 1 squared. Then we place 3 squares on the top, top right, and bottom of the square. The whole thing now has area 4. Now we place 5 squares on the same spot. The whole thing now has area 9. Now we place 7 squares on the same spots again. The whole thing now has area 16. Then we repeat this again and again. Plus 9, plus 11, plus 13, and so on. Until we reach 99. If you want to solve for the summary, you can just note what n is in on, the nth odd number. Add 1 to on, divided by 2, then square it, and there goes your answer. Wow, that's a great theory! I have one more thing to tell you. Really? What is it? Remember when I told you how to solve the equation? Yeah? That's similar to the trapezoid equation. Because in my equation, O1 is always 1. And O2 minus O1 is 2. O3 minus O2 is 2. O4 minus O3 is also 2. And so on. Oh, no wonder why that works. Now, did I just hear something ridiculous? Um, it's nothing. I said now you're happier. Oh, okay.